After countless hours of renovations and permit-related setbacks, owners of the 112-year-old Transit Hotel are hoping to open their doors in the next few weeks, for takeout at least. The second wave of COVID has shuttered restaurants for dine-in, and co-owner David Egan counts it as a blessing. You know, if we had everything work out according to plan, we would have had to, we would have been able to open um, late spring, perhaps, and then we would have had to shut down right away. City News spoke with transit hotel owners in July just as they were starting this monumental project. We ended up uh, repainting the walls, repainting the roof. It took about 250 liters of paint for just for that. Um, we refinished the floors. We had an old carpet in there that we pulled out. Egan and his business partner are hoping the Transit Hotel revamp will spur development in an area of the city forgotten by time. Egan says they've already seen demand for their barbecue menu, even though they had to delay their plans to open on New Year's Eve. Sadly, it just didn't work out. Um, again, we're just waiting on, on our final permits. But uh, yeah, we had about 20 people come come to our door and wanted to order. Egan tells City News he's been assured by the City of Edmonton that his permit approvals are imminent. He's hoping Edmontonians will come to check out the new looks and stay for the food. In Edmonton, Darcy Ropchan, City News.